So here I have version 1.0.7. I have everything set up just to show you how it works. So I have a body of water here. So if I walk here, this is based on root motion. Now I'm moving based on root motion, it's uh, animation driven. So I have uh, swim forward, I have swim, I have turn left, turn right. This is exactly the same system you have for walking on land. And I have uh, swim backward, then left, right. Then I have uh, swim forward left and swing forward right. Um, you can dismount your horse while you're swimming. Um, there's a restriction. You can jump either. So this is the only thing you can do. You can swim with your horse. And, and there you go. You're on land again. So this is a body of water. You can do this by go to plugins, uh, water, and you have to enable this uh, water plugin. It's still an experimental. If you want to use it, you don't have to use it. You can use different water. But the most important thing that you need is a physics volume that I have added here. All right. So let's set it up from scratch. Let's set it up from scratch. So I'm going to delete this one. Remember the setting 4010. This is what I used right and everything is our our lab all dynamics i'm going to delete that um go to physics volume place it here so i'm going to change the settings to what mind you can play around with different settings make sure you mark this water volume and let's give it uh what was it all right I think that's good. Right. It's slightly below the land, right? So this that's the setup. That's what you need. Play this. There you go. See that is based on um the physics volume you have. Um all right, now I'm going to show you the blueprint, the new code that went in version 1.0.7. So if you go ahead and open your components, and if you go to your writing system, all right, when you try to dismount, it's going to do this check. If you're not swimming, then it's going to dismount. Otherwise, it's not going to dismount. Um, that's the that's one. The second addition would be a this chunk of code right here with this logic. So this code is much simpler than the other ones because there's no jump here, uh, there's no ledge fall, there's no you know the uh, rearing or anything. Swing forward and swing forward turns, and this is for um, riders animations, right? This is for turn riders animations. Setting them here. I mentioned about doing some code consolidation for easier management, which is that I moved, I created from function called reset motions, right? So every time you add a new motion, you just add it here. So there's an uh, enum called e movement states, right? Which is under blueprint others here. So every time you, add, you want to add a new state, for example, if you want to add flying, let's say, so you would create a new uh, input here and call it flying, right? And it will show up here. Then you add all the resets that you want to do, right? So it's straightforward. This way it's going to be easier. And, and that's pretty much it. That's the new addition to 1.0.7.